1939, the armies of Nazi Germany begin their conquest of Europe. First of all is Poland, then Denmark, Norway, France, Belgium, Luxembourg, and the Netherlands. Now the year is 1941. With an army over seven million strong, the Nazi war machine turns to the east and begins the invasion of the Soviet Union. Using blitzkrieg tactics, they advance quickly, smashing relentlessly through the Soviet defenses and arrive at the capital city of Moscow in under four months. Desperately short of reinforcements, the Soviet defense of Moscow now falls to thousands of raw recruits who must hold out against the well-trained German forces in the freezing cold of the Russian winter. Welcome to basic training, comrades. If you wish to survive, you will do exactly as I say. Now, walk over to that table and pick up those weapons. You will have to move faster than that, comrade. You will need a real weapon if you wish to kill the fascists. Look at your compass. The star on the compass shows the location of your current objective. Now, go to the storeroom and get a pistol and a rifle. Move! The weapons are on the table, comrade. Good. Now go back and report to the commissar. Very good, comrade. Always remember to use the star on your compass to reach your current objective. Okay, Vasily. Let us see how good your aim is. Aim for one of those two teddy bears. Good, now fire at the other one. Pistols and submachine guns might be good for short range, comrade. But for long range targets, a rifle is better. Step up to the shooting range. Ready, comrades? Shoot those bottles and plates. Imagine that they are the enemy. Down your sights, Vasily. You will be much more accurate that way. Very good, comrade. Not bad, not bad. Very good, comrade. Not bad, not bad. That's enough, Vasily. Now. Let's see how well you can do under pressure. You have 15 seconds to shoot the helmets. Ready? Go! Good, comrade. Now come over here and bash this mannequin with your rifle. That's enough, comrades. Come over here and pick up a grenade. These are potatoes, comrade Commissar. Why are we using potatoes instead of real grenades? Because real grenades are valuable. In fact, they are worth a lot more than you are. Oh, uh, of course, comrade Commissar. My, my mistake. Now throw a potato into each of those marked target areas. Good throw. Not bad. Good throw! Comrade Commissar! Comrade Commissar! We've got a prisoner. Come take a look. Vasily, come with me. Uh, uh. <laughs> 
Hören Sie auf! Bitte töten Sie mich nicht! Unsere Truppen und so Mr. Position he says the enemy is moving. Behind our lines. Und, und to the southeast. Von Ketten and they are supported by half trucks and, and mobile artillery. Sir! There's a German attack forming to the southeast! It looks serious! Listen, comrades. There is an armory to the east in the basement of a house. Go there and load up on ammunition and supplies. I will stay and take care of our guest. Remember what you have learned. Good luck. We're going to take out some hydro workers, comrades. Grab a submachine gun and make sure you reload it first. Always make sure you have a full magazine before you go into battle. Let's go, comrades! Up the ladder! Vasily, wait! Don't run out there! Throw a smoke grenade first to conceal our movement! Wait! Wait for the smoke to build! Hold your positions, comrades! Just a bit more! All right! Go! Let's go! Assassin, use that broken wall for cover! Enemy infantry! Over by the head! We were in training. There is no better training, comrade, than fighting to survive. 